How do you become an authentic leader? Some people are born leaders, others struggle to make the right decisions. Every leader follows their true north or inner compass. Your true north represents who you are as a person. It is the fixed point that keeps you on course as a leader. Bill George has found that the most difficult person you will ever lead is yourself. When you finally manage to lead yourself through life's challenges and difficulties, you will find that leading others becomes quite easy. Discovering your true north requires a lifetime of commitment and learning. 1. Your life story guides your motivation. There is no such thing as an instant leader. Rather, becoming a leader is a journey that will take you through many trials and tribulations. Maintaining your authenticity during these times will be the greatest challenge you will ever face. Leaders start by asking themselves, what is my life story? Growing up in poverty, Schultz vowed to do everything differently if he ever had the chance. Today, he is responsible for one of the most successful companies in the world. 2. Losing sight of your true north leads to detrimental problems. Many leaders get lost on their path to leadership because they get caught up in their own success. George has identified five types of leaders who have lost sight of their true north. Loners believe they can and must go it alone. Without a support network, loners are more likely to make mistakes. Shooting stars focus their lives entirely on their careers. They often rise so quickly that they have little time to reflect or learn from mistakes. 3. Shifting your thinking from me to we. Many leaders lose themselves during their leadership careers because they get caught up in their own success. George has identified five types of leaders who have lost sight of their true north. Loners believe they can and must go it alone. Without a support network, loners are more likely to make mistakes. Shooting stars focus their lives entirely on their careers. They often rise so quickly that they have little time to reflect or learn from mistakes. 4. Becoming self-aware is crucial for any leader. Adobe CEO Bruce Chisholm felt insecure working in the technology industry because he was not an engineer. By becoming self-aware, he found real confidence that propelled him into a CEO position. Those who are at ease with themselves tend to be more open and transparent and also show their weaknesses. Self-awareness can help leaders fill the gaps in their skills with colleagues who compliment them. Dave Potrick, the former CEO of Charles Schwab, became self-aware after he was divorced for the second time. The experience allowed him to shine a light on his blind spots, and he realized he needed to take responsibility. 5. Set your leadership principles and ethical B-O-U-N-D-A-R-I-E-S. As a leader, you need to understand your values and the principles that guide your leadership. David Gergen was the first person to serve as a White House advisor to four U.S. presidents. Without a moral center, you will be swimming in chaos, says former Johnson & Johnson CEO Jim Burke. Jack Dorsey realized he was addicted to the glitz of power, glamour, and prestige. He knew he had to return to his authentic roots, which enabled him to advise Presidents Ford, Reagan, and Clinton. One way for leaders to set their ethical boundaries is to take the New York Times test. 6. Identifying your intrinsic motivation. Authentic leaders need to understand exactly what motivates them. In today's society, many people are too focused on material gain, temptations, and social pressures that drive them to pursue money and wealth. Authentic leaders must learn how to avoid this trap. Leaders often overlook their intrinsic motivation when they have become accustomed to a certain lifestyle. And more turned down a dozen job offers after business school and settled for the lowest paying offer at Time Inc. 7. Build your support team. Authentic leaders know they cannot succeed alone. That's why they build support teams they can confide in and celebrate success within times of need. Many authentic leaders have a mentor who helps them become better authentic leaders by helping them develop the skills they need. Bill Campbell is one of Silicon Valley's most respected mentors. Mentees like Bruce Chisholm, Donna Dabinsky, and Randy Commissar have helped Campbell build Claris. A good mentor is not just someone who supports you in every endeavor. Rather, a good mentor should challenge you every step of the way. 8. Living an INTGRATD Life Authentic leaders are true to themselves at work and at home. John Donahoe of eBay realized that he could flourish by relaxing, and this experience showed him that life could work with him. 
When you live an integrated life, you can bring together the most important elements of your personal and professional life. John Donahoe's wife had a job that required her to be at work at 7.30 in the morning, so he was the primary breadwinner. He quit his job as managing director of Bain's San Francisco office to take care of their two children. Those who follow their true north and let their inner compass guide their decisions have the greatest success as leaders. When you explore your true character and your true passions and motivations, you can begin to make decisions that are better for you, your work, and your family. For more book digests, check our other videos. See you soon!